All right, test one, two, Mike looking good. I see camera, I see Hollow Knight in the back. Welcome everyone to another episode of Muckluck Streams. I am your charming, self-proclaimed yet still humble host, Muckluck. And today we're continuing Hollow Knight. And I just noticed the login screen has changed since we beat the game. That's pretty wild. I've never seen, I, I cannot think of another game that where the, uh, the load up screens change after you've beaten the first playthrough. That is very interesting. So we're hopping back in there. Um, for those of you that might not have joined us yesterday, we beat the final boss of the story, but there's like dozens of more optional bosses that we can do. Um, there was also another quest we did that uh, I had to try three times. I had to carry a delicate flower across the world. And once we carried it over, we were able to... Um, turn it in uh, and I need to go get the reward from that but the delicate flower if I got hit one time if I took a single point of damage on my trek across the world I it was destroyed and I had to start over so that was rough so I'm let's go get the reward from that right now oh do I need to add XCOM 2 War of the Chosen to the pole white tiger <laughs> I, I could do that. That'll be a long playthrough. I could do that. I want to check the numbers on Twitch for any game that suggests... You know what? Hold on. I'm going to... I'm going to write that down right now. XCOM 2 or The Chosen. I'm going to write that down and look at the numbers. It's just after um, Pillars of Eternity 1 and 2 and... Uh, what did I do after that? Tower of Time... Um, you know, just all these really quiet sections of Twitch that I've done. I want to do a game that gives my channel a chance to grow. I've also been really grinding out uh, being social in a bunch of uh, Twitch communities today. Trying to uh, meet more people and make more connections. Like, literally, I spent hours today working on that. We'll see how that goes. Best for Vexus who's customizing chat's characters and killing them off. Hey, Joe. Hey, buddy. Me, Le Maire, you have done this thing. It is impossible. This world's cruelty. I thought it overwhelming, but Le Maire, such great compassion that Chis love would know her partner's heart even aeon past. Is it that, Le Maire, such grief can end, chick hand end? Ooh, and I, dear love, chit too can end. I. It's really weird. Solace. We just got an achievement. Oh, and a mask shard. Nice. I didn't even know we were getting a mask shard from this. God, is it possible to get a whole nother mask in this game? Probably, if we just got a shard. I thought we I thought we were done with that. I thought we had all the masks. Unless you're going to be jumping to An uh, Anthem or KH3. No, that would... no uh, I never played the Kingdom's Heart series. Um, I, I don't own consoles. And... I uh, actually had a friend that had extra beta keys for the uh, closed Anthem weekend last weekend. And, oh, shoot, I didn't realize this guy had respawned. And he gave me one of the keys, and my computer was at 100% CPU with Anthem on the lowest settings. I, I can't handle Anthem with my current rig. Um, I will add on to that, though. I'm not terribly interested in Anthem. Like, it hasn't hooked me. Uh, I haven't... I, I haven't seen, like, the customizations of it. It's just, I see, like, the four different suits that everybody wears. Like, Borderlands 2 was a shooter that hooked me, but in that game, you uh, had talent trees and stuff. So if Anthem has something like that, yeah, maybe I could get into it. But as a current stands, eh. Okay, that was the first thing I planned to do, and I've done did it. Um, what else? Kingdom's Edge has a path. Uh, we got the Colosseum. I got more to do in the Colosseum. Um, is there any... Oh, there's something down there in Deep Nest. And there's uh, one optional boss there in Deep Nest that I never ended up killing. I could try him again. Hmm. Let's do Kingdom's Edge first. Uh, so let's go to King's Station. And let's see what that path is. Anthem is Warframe with less content. 
Percentage, hobbits. I couldn't fit the whole thing in, and I thought that was very good abbreviation. Percentage. Anthem is more destiny. I, I did actually make the same comparison recently. I said Anthem to me looks like destiny, but you can fly. I don't know enough about Warframe to make a comparison. Secret tunnel. Oh, shoot. Okay, okay, we're, we're okay. Uh, how far east do I need to go? Hold on, hold on. I need to go all the way right, then all the way down. Uh, I don't know why I thought that little overhang would protect me, but I was wrong. It's okay. It's all right. We're only down two life. Okay. All right. What class would you play Guild Wars 2? So in Guild Wars 2, I actually spent like all day today playing Guild Wars 2, and I had an absolute blast. I played Guild Wars 2 at launch, and I have a, a friend... Um, who is really, really into it, who is trying to get me to try it again. And I haven't played Guild Wars 2 since, like, four years ago. So I opened the game up today, and I had an Engineer and a Ranger at max level. Um, engineer can make turrets in that game, the Ranger has an animal companion. And so I, he actually was like, you would love the Necro. So I made a Necro, and I played it to, like, level 30 today, and I was having an absolute blast. Like, the quality of life changes that they've done in that game were very good. Um, additionally, uh, <laughs> when I logged in, because I played it back in vanilla, I had seven years worth of birthday presents in the mail, so I got, like, all these transmogs and companion pets and stuff. But yeah, i currently playing around on a Necro. I'm just not sure if people would enjoy watching that. But I would... I wouldn't be doing, like, raiding. I would do lots of PvE short of raiding and PvP. Uh, just different suits and abilities. There are only four suits in Anthem so far. You've torn through this? We, uh, we beat the um, story mode final boss yesterday. Uh, however, I, I couldn't remember the name of some of the boss. I was editing the video for YouTube today, and I couldn't remember the name of all the bosses that I killed, and I was trying to put it in the description. So I, I googled, like, name of Hollow Knight bosses, and I was like, I'll recognize it when I see it. And there was, like, 15 bosses I didn't recognize on the list, and I was like, what the hell? Like, there is so much extra content in this game not rec Case in point, we just found a boss. Okay, okay. Because there's a, a very strong chance I'm not going to one-shot this guy, I'm going to get the bench that's below me. Oh, shoot. I, these guys respawn really fast. Really fast. Okay, uh, I need to go down again. And there was a bench to the right. Necro is also the tankiest class because of the second form. Yeah, the Death Shroud thing. He actually told me that's one of the reasons I would love the, the thing. It's like, when they do uh, certain types of damage, they get a shield called Death Shroud. And when it's active, Death Shroud bar goes down instead of hit point bar. And uh, there's a talent at max level where when you would take lethal damage, if you have any Death Shroud charged up, uh, you automatically go into the Death Shroud state. Uh, yeah, so, I mean, that looks awesome. Oh my. I gotta remember how to fight these things. <laughs> Not like this. We kill them with thorns. That's how we fight those things. We kill them with thorns. Okay. Here's the bench. We now have the bench closest to this new boss we just discovered. Trying to figure out, because this may end up being a corpse run, so I'm trying to figure out any tricks I can to get back quickly. Oh, that was a short burst, wasn't it? Alright. 
It's like two long crystal jumps and then just manual. Seriously, these guys respawn anytime you look away from them. Still need to use the elegant... Thank you. I do still need to use the elegant key. Th that shield next to him looks like that shield trinket that orbits me. All right, hold on. If this ends up being a fight, I want to know the layout of this room. All right, is that it? Uh, it's mirror seven platforms in the air. Okay. You've come a long way just to die here at the edge of the world. No, do not speak. I have heard thousands and thousands of empty words from those like you. Your pride, your desires, your desperation. You'll take these things with you once I strike you down. Wow. He's like, I don't give a shit. Raise your weapon then and die like those who came before you. Let's go! Speaking of shield... Oh! Oh, hey. Oh, his, uh, his doesn't just keep orbiting him like mine does. Oh, whoa, what the? <laughs> oh my gosh, I completely lost track of my character there. Oh, they're spawning underneath me. What the heck? Oh no, oh no, oh my gosh. Woo, woo, hot foot. Oh my gosh, this is gonna take a bit. We got some soul back, that was good. Oh man, well we, we thorns him. Wait, what? He's got a second shield now. Oh my gosh. Oh my God. <laughs> Oh, wow. Oh, wow. So much. So it's like four swords in the air and two shields orbiting him. And the shields do damage as well as block me. Oh, man. You know, I should have changed. Um, I should have changed out gathering swarm and the compass. If I die again, I am gonna swap those two out for something that will help me on the boss. It's very possible I was in the last phase, but I don't know how much was left. That was weird. It looked like the shade hit the boss. Uh, White Tiger, I need a joke. Raise your weapon, then fool and die like those who came before you. Oh, man. Ah, I was just trying to get the gas on him.
Oh! <gasps> wow, I am surprised that worked. That was a panic click. Oh, really? Oh, man. No, come on. Oh, I was dashing. I was totally dashing. Yes! Yes! Oh, second try. Oh my gosh. He honestly, it felt like he had really low hit points. It was just really hard getting to them. Never have I been defeated in combat. I could see myself there, still sleeping. How long have I been hidden here? Here at the edge of the world, no one could find me except you. Warriors, knights, kings, even time itself, they have no power over me, only you. You are the darkness, come to consume me. Nom 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 nom. Nice, that was like 200 essence? Okay. I was gonna say, I would be surprised, like, I, if there was like a uber version of this fight, I would kind of be shot because that was really hard as it was. Excuse me. If there was like three or four um, <laughs> swords and then like four shields, is like I don't even know what you would do. What did you get as a reward? Uh, 200 essence. I'm over a thousand now. Have any of you played Fallout New Vegas? I am not. Fallout... What was the most recent one that was single player? Was it was that four? That was the uh, first Fallout I ever played. And I played through the whole game like three times. I really enjoyed it, but that was the only one I ever played. Oh, shoot. Oh, no! No! Oh. Guys, I almost died right there. I had one health. Oh, man. Okay. Well, we killed a boss. We, we opened up that little chunk of the map. What's next? Where did the elegant key go? Wasn't that somewhere in um, Soul Sanctum? I think that was Soul Sanctum. I'm going to head toward a tram, and then once I'm there, we can figure this out. Wait, what are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? Go away. What is this? I have never seen them do that. Will you, will you come up here and be really easy to kill as well? Wumpa, 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 wumpa. Oh. I was trying to see if I could kill it with poison. Ah, almost perfect. Almost perfect. And not perfect. <laughs> hey, base. How's it going, buddy? Oh, no. Ah, oh, sneaky sneak. Yeah. 
Oh, that's right, this is the short jump. Uh, wait, did I go too far? No, I need to go down and then left more. I, I went up too early. Accidentally let some of them get behind me. Our soul was completely full, including the side tanks, though, so not a big deal. You need junk food. Uh, okay, so now I need to go up and then left. Oh no! I was wondering if the swarm was going to get those. <laughs> A triad. Ooh, close. Oh, well, it's fine. We dodged the bat. No! The paternity sleeping into your wounds. Why are you wounded? Uh, okay. Wasn't the elegant key location somewhere in here? my lawn. I think it was somewhere to the west of here. Oh, you guys. <sighs> oh, I mistimed that one. Ah, would you just die? Oh my gosh, he was so low that just barely touching that poison cloud killed him. Alright. I know there... Was this one of the locked doors? No, that's not it. What was this one? Okay, that's not it. Apparently, if you hit the down key or the up key while standing in front of the door, you zone in. Is this it? Simple door with the... Oh, use simple key. So here's something that I haven't done before. Ooh, la la, look at the painting. Songstress Marissa, a voice to ease all burdens and still all troubled minds. Mm -mm. Uh, wait, what are these side passages that you're skipping? Marissa. <laughs> Is songstress Marissa like a boss and she's going to be at the top? Ooh, Geo. What's this? Wanderer's Journal. All right. All right. So that's one. There were three side passages. Two, three. Is this the same one I already talked to? Was there four side passages? I guess there were four. Five. Whoa! 
Hey, Skyline with the host. Thanks, buddy. <laughs> Made me jump. Welcome, welcome. <laughs> 